Hello everyone, and welcome back to Nemoria. Uh, we left off building the fence at the top of this section of our wall, and it's going along quite well. We have uh, most of it done, honestly. And, um... Then we can f try and work on the final tower. We should probably put torches along the top of our wall as well. Just feel like that's a good idea. Let there be light. Hopefully that'll light up most of it. Cause I just feel like it should be lit up. Oh look at my little farmers being so good about harvesting all the food. We have 1400 food, almost 1500. I don't think we're gonna starve this winter. Nor do I think our animals will starve with 1300 wheat to eat. There's this bear just running around. Bar. Okay. How goes life down here? That was a strange little thing. Okay. We've got lots of things being done. Both brewers are working hard. I, I wish I knew, like, how well we were doing. In terms of that. Because, like, we keep trading for drinks. But, like, aren't we managing to keep up with the two distilleries? Like, with our kingdom's needs? Because I want to guess no. <laughs> but maybe we are. I mean, you know, it's possible. Alrighty. Still waiting for a few more statues. Yeah, I feel like we're not probably keeping up, but I mean, hey, if we are, that's great. We could work on some more uh, vein mining as well. Try and get all of the possible usable materials from here. These are only 19 long. They are. They're not supposed to be 19 long, they're supposed to be 20 long. Hopefully we'll find some malachite, because I still think green floor in our metal room would be awesome! But we haven't seen Malachite in a really long time, so maybe we just already harvested it all. I mean, maybe we did. It's not out of the question, right? Well, we found um, some coal by the looks of it. Yeah? Is that what this is? Or is it tin? No, it's cool. I'm not good at telling the difference. I wish I were. I know tin is like silver, but when it's not lit, it's difficult to tell. And then there's tin and silver, where they're both like silver. And it's just like, oh boy. So many things. I saw someone walking by with a plank. Where are you going with a plank? He's going downstairs with it, I thought. People should only be going upstairs with planks. Because they're going here. Okay, so we didn't quite light this section in the middle. Now the middle section looks sad because it's dark. 
So I will build another torch. So that it will not look sad. Oh wow, really? Over here, it's here. And this one doesn't have it in yet, but there may be a need for another one like right here. In fact, I think there will be. So we'll just put those down because I, I want it to look bright and happy. A little happy wall. Look at all the oranges just laying about in the field. We will eventually eat all of you oranges, don't worry. In this game, food does not go bad, so we don't have to worry about that. Oh gosh, game, why you do that? Don't do that. Resume. We don't even have all of our torches down here yet. Oh, I'm paused. All of the mining. Looking for the Malachites. I'm really hoping we find some soon. But even if we do, how do we make sure that the malachite bars we make are actually used for the floor? Like, I'm worried they'll be snatched up by someone who, like, wants to, like, make a statue or make armor or something else in this general vicinity of the kingdom. It wouldn't be good. Can we discover a new kingdom? We haven't done that in ages. Do we need to break like 400,000 total kingdom worth? Because we kind of know four. And you know three, of, you know two of them starting out? Because one's the goblin kingdom. And I wasn't counting them in the four we know. And so. You know the Goblin Kingdom, so I think you know these two when you start, and then you gain the others. So we've gained three so far. So maybe you get to find one like every hundred thousand in Kingdom Worth or so? Hmm. It's a guess. It might be right. I mean, who knows? But maybe if we can get up to four hundred thousand, we'll get to, to see a new kingdom, neighboring kingdom. It's gonna take us a while to get up there though. Alrighty. I want these to be built so I can put in this last one. I'm just worried if, you know, if they build these two first, then we'll build in the corner. And then it looks weird. Are all my builders sleeping? Come on guys. Oh, a couple of them are sleeping, one's building a statue, and then all the others are building torches. I did put down a lot of uh, orders for torches. This guy's a really slow builder. Took him forever to install that torch. Alrighty, well, at least soon our uh, kingdom will be lit up like a beacon. I'm not sure that's actually a good thing. But whether or not it's a good thing, that's what's going to happen. Because the top of my walls will be happy and lit. Did you just steal someone else's planks? I feel like everybody's stealing each other's planks when they're doing this stuff. Also, I love how they just use different woods so we get like this mosaic of a fence. It looks cool. I like it. Alright, we're actually working on these. Just need them to do the corner one. That's all I need them to do. Come on, guys. You can do it. I, the, all three of these are green. Supposedly, they are all being built. Yes. I can put in that last rail fence. One time I did a picket fence around the top of my wall. And that just looked weird. Didn't like it. A picket fence goes like on the ground like I, I associate it like these fences with like they go around your yard and stuff like that we could have done fences around our uh, livestock pens but then you have 
I'm not sure if you can put a door in a fence. Like, can you put a door? Like, could I put a door here? I actually have no idea if you can do that. My guess would be no. Yeah, you can't. Look. No door. We're almost done. <gasps> We're almost done. You're the slow one, though. Yeah, no, he gave up. Okay, well, we've pretty much finished the fence around this part. To protect our soldiers. So maybe we can start with that final tower now. Look at this weak golem core. I don't even know what you'd use those for. I really don't. If anybody knows and wants to tell me, feel free to. Alrighty. Really? This is the one I'm supposed to do? I thought it was this one. Nope. It's this row, okay. Let's come in and fell the trees. Let's come in and um, remove ramps. Let's come in and mine the wall. There we go. Something for everyone to do. Once that's done, we can actually lay down the first wall. Saving game. Woo! Alrighty, let's get some basalt. Ah, uh, more trees. Shoulda known. Shoulda looked. Didn't look. Thought I had this figured out. Oh, because I thought it was one farther in. That's why I thought I had it all figured out. Of course. And then you figure out that you were miscalculating and everything has gone wrong. What on earth is it? A tin golem has appeared? Where? One, seriously, where? Oh, there he is. Tin Golem, attack all squads. Please don't kill my builder. I have need of him. Okay, I was like, where is my military? Oh no. Okay, we'll attack him next. Oh. What about the tin golem? Guess we're dealing with them one at a time. Oh, well that one guy's still over here with him. With his, uh, flintlock pistol. Okay. I'm sure that they have this under control. My, my soldiers are very capable of having this under control. Okay. Build. What is this, though? Look. Hmm. How's my phone doing? Alrighty. Copper Golem has died. Good. Okay. So... Looks like we're going to have, oh boy, there we go. We'll leave a space for the door, and then grab 
actually gonna have to build like a piece in under it if we want to have like a sealed um, tower. So we're gonna do that. Stairs up, stone. We'll do the salt stairs. Goblins! Goblins, goblins, goblins. Engineer. Sound the alarm. Please actually do it. Where's my engineer? Sleeping. This is why I need more engineers. Okay, we have three raiders and a soldier. First raider is not bleeding. Second raider is bleeding. Third raider, I can't click on, is bleeding. Oh, the alarm was sounded. Sound. And the soldier is not bleeding. Although we can check the first raider again, they might be bleeding now. And they are indeed. I'm just gonna go f telling uh, my gnomes to fix up the doors behind the goblins. One goblin bled to death. Did two die? I guess two must have died. Oh, this raider is not bleeding though, and the soldier is not either. So that's bad. They're just gonna keep on hitting that door until it falls over. Whoops. At least we have food and drinks, so no one needs to go up to the surface for anything, and there's a wild alpaca running around. Always wonderful. Silly alpaca. Like, this guy's got malachite armor. Where'd you get your armor? Where'd you get the malachite? We've been out of malachite for like years here. At least we killed all the golems. Although I think military members will still leave to train. Yeah, these guys are training. But no one's training over here. And I think this is in... Oh wait, no, they're not. They're not in the overnight one. They're in the morning session. You guys can't beat a simple wooden door. It's really kind of funny. I thought all the raiders were bleeding, but maybe they switched positions around when they moved. So in the list, they were listed in a different order. That's probably what happened. Well, at least everyone is safe. At least everyone should be safe. 55% water. I thought this was a gnome. Why do they discard their skull helmets and then just never pick them back up again? It's crafted by Yinkle, but who does it belong to? Who should I yell at for leaving their clothes strewn about the kingdom? The sun has risen and the goblins are still trying to knock down one door. I think the wooden doors are sturdier than the stone doors, because the stone doors seem to go faster. <laughs> but you wouldn't think that'd be the case. But apparently it is. Maybe these are reinforced wooden doors and there is science behind it. That's probably it. You came up here for a food? We have no food stored down below. We have 1,500 food and no one moved it downstairs. Yep, our crates are empty. Oh. Going up for a food. I have so many crates and so many places we can stockpile food. No one ever stockpiles any of it. We should have a hauling career where that's all they do. Except it's difficult to waste labor on that. Because there are other things that need to be done. later than I us it usually is when I record, so I'm a little tired. But I've had a busy day, and it's been a good day. It's been a good day. Mostly. Hopefully you have all had wonderful days as well. 
Oh, I can put in my order for the door. I think it would be interesting to put a uh, an alarm bell in one of the towers. Because if we did that, then we could um, have everyone just flock to the tower when the goblins attacked. And I think that'd be really interesting to see. Uh, fine, we can have soil floor here. I'm not picky. I'm just lazy and I don't want to fix that problem. This tower has already posed too many problems. Did the goblins leave? They get tight? Nope. This is going to be one of those times where they're hitting the same door for three days before they go. Like, aren't you guys thirsty? Or hungry? Yeah, now they're thirsty. Like, the other one's wearing steel. Like, this, the raider will go down no problem. But the soldier? Like, look at that. That's scary. Won't go down so easily, and he's really well armored. I think he's wearing full steel armor. Yeah. It's all worn, though. So that if we kill him, we can't just, like, automatically use it. We have to smelt it down and remake it. If we want to use the steel. And you get less steel when you smelt it down, I'm pretty sure. So we wouldn't be able to make a full set either. Oh, boy. How did neither of these... Oh, wait, no, this one did. I was like, how could neither of those traps have gone off? But the iron just blend in, blends in with the uh, basalt really well. Oh my god, you're gonna have... Like, everyone's gonna pass out after after this one. Ooh, we found sapphires, though. I thought I saw that when I accidentally, like, flipped between floors. Oh, we found some coal, too. Might as well get some... Uh... Oh, one of the goblins has died! I don't know of what. Probably thirst. So cool. Oh. It's a goblin over here. Did they leave? No. They didn't leave. Did they send reinforcements? I think they sent reinforcements. And it died. It must uh, maybe I found that monitor lizard I saw running around earlier. Might as well get this done while we're waiting for the goblins. Then my gnomes will have so many things to do when they wake up from collapsing out of exhaustion when I uh release them. It's so difficult when it's dark to tell if there's coal in any of these. I don't think there is. But once it's lit, we'll know for sure. These guys are some of the most persistent goblins. Although I don't know why there was a goblin over there. Oh my goodness, extra alpacas just starting up in the wheat storage room again. We're gonna have a wild animal party. The rain has stopped. Goblins have not. Oh boy. I don't want to send my military to fight them. What if they die? I would be so sad. We haven't had a military death in a while, and I like it that way. So I saw someone going up there. Must have been for food. Everyone's walking. What is this? No! Absolutely not. So one of my friends thinks that this is where goblins come from, but that can't be true because then goblins would have walked directly into my great hall. And I would know if they'd done that. Oh look, the the soldier is getting tired and seems to be leaving. He's tired of carrying his heavy armor, or her heavy armor. I think it was a girl. 
And he's like, nah. She's like, nah, I'm good. And is running away. I'd have preferred if he ran away a little faster. See, they definitely disappear through those things. And this one's shown up more than once, I think, in that exact spot. Alrighty, is everyone gone? Yes. Wonderful. I love it when everyone is gone. We got three goblins out of that. So, pretty soon we'll have goblin sausage for breakfast. Let's watch everyone collapse. Did our engineer already collapse? Where is our engineer? 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 Where are you? Are you sleeping again? What are you doing? You're going to get food. Really? You better be planning- oh my god. More food. Just gonna grab a mushroom. I think it's a she actually. Tink sounds like a female name. Tink! Go and ring that bell! We're gonna end up being in here for four days because of you. Thank you. Boom, everyone's asleep, including the engineer. It's like a surprise slumber, slumber party. Look, surprise. Alrighty. Well, we can wait for them to wake up in the next episode. If you enjoyed this episode of Nemoria, be sure to hit that subscribe button. And as always, I'm the Purple Pegasus, and I'll see you in the next one. Bye bye